No, I'm actually really excited. I've never interviewed anyone like you, so. Huh? This is gonna be a little nerve wracking. I'm, I'm, I'm really excited. I just, I've never interviewed anyone like you. Yeah. I'm very excited for your change. I don't know how they're gonna react to this. Huh? Let me do my little intro and then we can get our one on one. You might have to take that hoodie off. I just feel really comfortable with the hoodie on. I'll take the hoodie off. They're gonna wanna see what's new and the glasses. Take them off. Like, I like my glasses. My grandma gave me these glasses. They're Dior. Why would I take them off? Like, sponsor Dior. Hi. We're not hiding from anyone here. We're all friends and family. They, they should be understanding. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. It's me, Andrea. And today I'm gonna be interviewing somebody, well, that you guys know and my love. I don't know how much you guys love her. Here's the interview. My surprise guest is. You're gonna have to take those glasses and the hoodie out. They want to see who you are. No, it's just, it's really cold. Like, it's really cold. But then, like, the sun, like, it's sunny, so that's why I have my glasses on. My first question is, can you please take the hoodie and sunglasses off? I, I can take the glasses off. I can take the glasses off. Well, I, I have a question for them. Can I ask it? You have a question for them. What do you guys think I did differently? I personally think that you got your nose done. You know, it's really a clumper. I mean, <laughs> not my nose. Why would I? I don't think I have that bad of a nose. Do I have a bad nose? Like, <sighs> Oh, it's not that. You like your nose. Oh. I like your nose, too. It's actually... It's a cute little button nose. <laughs> Awkward. How about you just tell us what you did? I don't even know if I'm emotionally ready for this right now. Are you ready? We're all loving and family here. You just take off the hoodie, take off the glasses. What's gonna happen? Ta-da! Did you just... You look scared. Okay, um, that's not the reaction I was waiting for. We need a break. Stop. Cut, cut, cut. Are you kidding me right now? Did you just dye your hair? Yes, this, this is real life. You need our permission to be doing things like this. I did not need permission from you. I'm so sorry. I can't believe they did that to you. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Freaking out! Who the hell gave you permission to do this, Andrea? Who gave me permission? I gave myself permission. You did know. You did know. I don't even have any more questions for you. I. Can you guys even continue this interview? Like, we were going so well. We thought you had a nose job. You should have got a nose job. Why did you tie your hair? Well, the fact that you don't like it is kind of making me a bit insecure right now. Maybe once I have it styled, should I go? I'll style it and I'll come right back. Hold on. Better? I'm gonna go. It was nice interviewing you. I quit, though. Take this microphone off. You still looked freaked out. Okay. Quit. Uh, you can take over this interview. I'm just gonna let you guys talk to her now because I'm done with her. You're just gonna go. You're gonna leave me alone with him? You're just gonna go? Okay, well, somebody's angry. All right, well, I'm gonna take over, but can I move it somewhere else because I don't like this position? Enjoy the new Andrea. And I'm sorry this is the last you guys see of me. Guess it's just me and you guys now. Oh, are we gonna take the elephant in the room? I got a new emoji pillow. Thank you, Ale. They're so cute. She handmade them. It's like the cutest thing ever. I'm so nervous to even speak to you guys. And this happened. It's not a Hannah Montana wig. Threw that one away a couple days ago. I'm blonde now. Yeah. I know. Please do not kill me. That's all I ask. I want it to be gray hair, like gray hair, and then like it didn't stay in my hair. Literally, you can only see on the bottom, like the ends of my hair are gray now. But it's like the top of my hair, it's just blown out. Like Queen Elsa in this bitch. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what to say. Yes, I want to say thank you, first of all, for the thousand subscribers. I know everyone's telling me that I'm such a baby and I need to get over it and it's not that big of a deal. But to me, it actually is a really big deal. Like, I cried. One of you guys actually tweeted to me and I was like, wait, what? I didn't think I was going to hit it, if that makes sense. So once somebody tweeted it to me, I started crying. And it was awkward because there was a lot of people around me that were definitely not YouTubers. And they're looking at me like, what the heck? Never been blonde. And I thought... Might as well, so I'm sorry if it's something new, I'm sorry if it's weird, I'm sorry that I feel like a bunch of you guys are going to hate me for it. Please don't hate me. Tell me what you guys honestly think without breaking my heart, because honestly, I'm freaked out about it. Some people said they really liked it, some people were comparing me to some celebrities, and I was like, I don't see it, but okay, so, I don't know, let me know what you guys think of the hair, like, do I look like somebody? What do you guys personally think about it? Do you guys hate it? It's okay, comment it below. Are you guys going to unsubscribe because I did my hair blonde? I really hope not. But I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about it. And besides that, 
basically it was all bleached homegirl was trying to leave it orange and I almost died I wanted it to be gray she's like it's just a golden blonde I was like no like it was orange like I look like Eminem when he first bleached his hair and I was like I'm not doing this if I look like anyone you guys know comment below like whether it be celebrity or just maybe your great aunt I don't know <laughs> what am I saying my brother's friend did it for me so I'll insert here some clips and things like that of like the process we recorded a little bit of it but I wasn't gonna sit there and record all because once I saw the orange I freaked out and I stopped filming everything Sorry, but here's a little bit of those clips that I'll insert right here. Is it like, does it look like it's in focus? I don't know, I'm holding it now. <laughs> sure. I don't know. Hair change. Yes. so scared. Have to say hi. Hi, we're gonna color her blonde. This is so exciting, I'm so scared too. Okay. Oh, let me focus it. Ooh, so yummy. <laughs> it is not frosting, I do not cook. <laughs> this is definitely color. <laughs> I had some snapchats that day I snapchatted that you guys saw that there was like guys in the video you guys were like where are you you're obviously not at a salon because I see a pool and I see like three random guys who are these guys you're not at a salon obviously and I actually did it at my brother's house even his roommates were all there and it was just awkward because it was like I felt uncomfortable I was going all blonde and I had these three guys just sitting there and I thought like they're not gonna be entertained by between my hair but at one point the three of them were just sitting there and I'm just like Looking at the girls doing my hair, and I'm like, they're just sitting there watching me, and I'm like, okay, this is happening. I Snapchatted one of them, you guys were like, wait, aren't you doing your hair? Where are these random guys coming from? One of them walked in, I was like, I should be Snapchatting this. I was like, please don't do that. I'm freaking out already. We're going to buy the gray hair dye, and then that, like, tamed the orange. So my hair is not orange, thank God. It's like a white, blondie, like, yellow, light, yellowy, gray type of deal. I don't know what I'm making sense of here. It was just really awkward, because I had Asif and Alonzo, and they are like, he's like, I like it. And then Alonzo was like, you look like a carrot top, and I was like, I'm gonna die. I went to go pick up my brother's friend on our way back. He's like, oh, it looks nice. And I was like, you've never seen me before. And he's like, yeah, I have. And I was like, oh, you have? It was awkward because I didn't remember meeting that guy. But hi, if you're watching, you're probably not. I don't even know what to say. I just, I honestly want to know you guys' opinions and what you guys think about it. If you guys hate it, tell me because I want to know. But don't be mean about it. Like, you could just say, like, I prefer the brown hair, you know? Don't say you look ridiculous. You look ugly because that's going to break my heart and I'm going to cry because I already feel the comments coming in. So just be like, I prefer the brown hair. Just say it like nicely. So <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will talk to you guys in the next one. And yeah, bye everyone. Please, please be nice in the comments.